Greg Zanis, and I'd like to show you some of the compartments in this beautiful 1927 Cadillac. If you take a look here on the floor, there's a compartment, and this compartment would be used for several things. One thing would be you can throw nails in a car that's pursuing you. Also, you can hide some weaponry in there. I'd like to show you one of these doors here. If you take a look at it here, you see this heavy, heavy armor tempered steel plating that would stop anything from 45, 38, any kind of a pistol. And then every one of the doors has a hidden compartment that you can place armament in. There'd be four or five people riding in this car. They all had access to a pistol. And you could, of course, see that the, the handles were countersunk in here. This would be the door handle. This would be the window crank. That would be the lock. If you take a look further inside here, you'll see, I don't know if you can see this or not, but this is a panic bar. So when somebody's chasing you, you grab onto that, and the driver can go around the corners as fast as he wants. Take a look here, and there's a heavy steel plate on the back. Also, the back window was not a bulletproof glass, but all the windows had drop-down curtains on them. Like this. And I don't know if you can see this one, but it's, it's got a gun port on it. So when you're being chased, you drop the window down, and you can shoot your guns out the back window if you're being chased by somebody. And then take a look on all the sides. You may not be able to see this, but there's heavy, heavy armor plating here, here. And then behind me, there's armor plating on this door also. And, of course, there's a compartment that you can put your gun in. The front door compartments are a lot smaller. So while this would hold a larger pistol, like a 45, this this front door one would hold something like a snub nose 38 revolver, much smaller. And, of course, you can see across there, the driver's door has a pistol holder on it. If you take a look here... You see these heavy, heavy plates. We don't actually have them properly installed right now, but I'd like to show you one of these plates. I'm taking it out here. Take a look here. These, these were bulletproof. They made sure the perimeter of the window was covered, up to the door was covered. This overlapped a little bit. Every one of the windows has a plate that covers over that. And I'm Greg Zanis. Thank you very much.